Sagittarius. Graham rising. Sagittarius. Rise and shine. Rise and shine. Sagittarius. Welcome to Sag Life Tarot. I am Shannon. I am a Sagittarius. For my newcomers, welcome in. For my subscribers and my friends, welcome back. Thank you for being here with me. I am yet still away from home. Couple more days, guys, and I'm gonna be done babysitting. Oh, they better have the time of their life. Pray with me, won't you? God created source energy vibrations Holy Spirit holy angels guardian angels ancestors mother and father source energy all things humbly we come before you in gratitude thank you goodness love joy peace mercy Prosperity, long life, happiness. From me to you, Sagittarius. Hey, man. Welcome, 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 welcome. If you hit that like and subscribe button, thank you so much. You are supporting me for free. I do not reach out to anybody and ask to read for you. No, and I know they get fake pages with my name and my picture. Even on the website called Tagged. Look at that, Eight of Swords. I seen it when, we was sh when I was shuffling the deck. Eight of Swords already in your mind. Wake up in your mind. Got so much on your mind. Some things you've been through, but you in the full energy. You're ready to take some leaps of faith. You might have been caught up thinking, should I leave? Should I stay? Should I go? Or no. You, whatever it is, you've been thinking hard on this. And you could be influenced by what other people think. With this Eight of Swords, the full energy. This is that energy of stepping out on faith. Just taking a risk, going into the unknown, death and rebirth, the definite end of something, but the beginning of something, the end of something you was going through emotionally, mentally going through. There's an emotion here because the fool was here. You was thinking for a long time with you swords, you contemplating on what it is. You should do what it is you shouldn't do. Which move should you make? Should you move at all? Should you take this leap of faith and move to a different state? <sighs> Go on and do it. Page of Wands. Go on and take the opportunity. Not Page of Pentacles. Oh my God, it's going to be a fresh, young opportunity. A new adventure. New horizons, new financial security. And these feel now I got to take it like this. Page of Wands. Page of Pentacles, Eight of Cups in reverse, Two of Pentacles in reverse, and King of Pentacles. Now, on the bottom of the deck, when I was shuffling that deck, that King was real seriously glow. It was glowing, like, and for it to come out after I was, it was on the bottom of the deck. If you play this back in, to the beginning, this was on the bottom of the deck, and I was shuffling a couple times, and it stayed on the bottom of the deck. And I was going to make mention of it. I did in my mind. But for it to actually come out. This is Eight of Cups in Reverse. Two of Pentacles. This is staying in a situation. Having already not. 
having already made a decision, but not decided upon certain aspects of the decision. Still coming up with thoughts, just jumping out there without actually putting it into writing, without actually planning it, but having the plan that this is what I'm doing. Page of Pentacles, somebody bringing me in a message for you. This Page of Wands could possibly be somebody who is throwing out energy, throwing out uh, positive radiant energy that is attracting in new opportunities, new uh, somebody coming with a, mm, a contract being signed. When I see stuff like the Page of Pentacles, this is somebody young this fresh young energy this is in a sense this is uh up and coming knowledge learning knowledge looking for knowledge right here with this page of pentacles meditating on the things that's going to get you to where you're going making a plan but staying the course keeping it going standing strong for whatever it is whatever this situation that has already come to a conclusion and a conclusion meaning that it came to this end or this beginning it came to this end or this beginning and now you stayed the course this divine energy i just feel so deeply like somebody is so led by what you can't see. This card was radiating at the bottom of the deck when I was more, and I'm going to go back and look at it myself because I looked at it a few times and it's like it had a glare to it. Like somebody, feminine or masculine energy, somebody is moving energy <clears throat> somebody is moving energy somebody is throwing out there they plans they wants their desires their uh, somebody is throwing out here putting it down on paper writing about it learning about it meditating on it believing that it's coming in and staying the course believing in it and, and and stable on that one fixated situation, but it's causing you to gain more and more knowledge. Somebody could have been sick for a while, feeling a whole lot better. Somebody could have been emotionally sick right uh, uh, for a, a moment with this Eight of Cups in reverse. Somebody could have been so emotionally sick for a moment. Eight of Swords stuck in their mind for a moment, but now you feel so much better. You have got knowledge now. Something has come. Something has struck you. Something has come to you to let you know it's okay and look at you resting in your, it's okay. Mm. Let's put some money out here. Oh, death. You got that Scorpio energy, fool. That's water energy, air. Earth is here. Everything, all of the elements is here. You know what? I don't see no wands, but oh yeah, period. Everybody here. Do and you? It's like you attracting something, something that's gonna hold you up. Even though you're ready to fall into the unknown, something going to hold you up. Some be, somebody starting their own business. Next level, boss up. Next level, be a boss. Somebody starting their own business. Don't be intimidated. Elevate your awareness. CEO positions. This is somebody moving up. This is somebody having worked hard. Stood their ground. Stood in what it is they believe in. And you might have a new mental understanding or something. A new emotional understanding. Whatever you doing, it's going to cause you to have King of Pentacles energy. Look at that. Luck is on your side. You about to change. You about to change. Somebody about to be in social media. Somebody about to go viral. Somebody is in the internet blowing it up. Somebody is doing so much right now. Somebody is possibly... Look at this. I feel this energy real strong. Set them goals out there 
uh, uh, believe in the impossible. Believe that things are working in your favor. This luck energy would suggest Jupiter energy is here. So I will say that everything that you are desiring, even if even if for some it's so uh it's so outside of imagination people would be so like get out of here you not about to and then all of a sudden you playing the piano on stage at somebody's concert <laughs> oh that's for somebody life purpose that's for somebody is about to get it somebody about to get what it is they set out for stage it could be you where your man at where you level it where you at be a boss as you about to get this business started as you about to go on out here and get on this stage and let people see the real you somebody in the music entertainment field something unstable something unstable there's been lots of ups and downs but it's a rescuer here thank you someone may enter your life and help you resolve difficult situations denial perhaps you are insisting reality be something other than what it is <laughs> let's put love out here <coughs> excuse me someone may enter your life and help you resolve difficult situations that you could be experiencing that's a rescuer for some coughing you cannot pull these things out of bag ending new beginning a change self-indulgence somebody is changing loving people more than they love themselves and they say shadow work and self-appreciation and understanding and loving yourself more <laughs> really some more energy for Sagittarius please let's not overdo it let's not overdo it I just feel like deeply you want to overdo it. Heart with a key. Welcome and love in. Could be meeting the one for some. I like you, someone likes you, Sagittarius. Let's get energy out here. Energy company. Holy Spirit, oh, the angels speak for these cards. 12, the temple path. Whew. Life purpose. It's a part of your life purpose. You are divinely called. You will have new ideas and inspirations. Ask for what you need and things will align to carry out your vision. Whew. What did we just say? Somebody was looking at me. Come on now. You got your eye on yourself. Look here. Self-indulgence. Time to heal. Focusing on self. Okay. Getting together with somebody else. Uh, and love is here, so the temple. Somebody could be getting married now. Somebody's little relationship could be a bigger relationship. Number 27, walking away. What? You walking away from something. And you walking away clean, too. But wait a minute now. You done turned around and looked back. Number 29, the world is here. Well, somebody traveling, somebody going out of town, somebody is going to move. I see a new, uh, new outfit, new car for some. Number 33, door to romance. What? What we said? Number 40, sixth chakra, archangel Metatron. Number 11, cornucopia. Let's see what else we can get out of Kipper. Kipper, deliver a short message, won't you? In your own words, we already know Kipper is for somebody. Mm, number 33. It's a reason to be concerned about something. Okay. Cornucopia. Somebody's harvest is coming in. Somebody's uh, wealth. We had that King of the Pentacles. Somebody's wealth. It helped even is improving. Oh, and then I got bad health. Y'all, look at this health with great fortune. 
number 26 you know what that means that bad health ain't no bad health no more and somebody about to be revived here we say it here look come on Pippa. you better come through like you know what the storyline is number two main female somebody about to get some good wealth out of this not just that somebody about to have i'm telling you somebody's harvest is here now we all in different seasons one thing might resonate for you and the other thing may not. Baby, take a look at his plates. Hmm. Mama Bank ain't gonna tell you nothing like climbing rose book bush consequences. Look at that. Look at that. In the same garden. You growing a garden over here? A garden full of wealth and good health. I see you, Sash. I see you. Hey, it's all positive love and inspiration here because I want you to excel in life. <coughs> Symbols. Balance. Somebody could know somebody in the law. Somebody could be a lawyer. Air elements. State of mind. Okay. A lot of thinking. What we said, it's a lot of thinking going on out okay? here. A lot of getting it together, though. Lavender, luck, and tranquility. Now, didn't you have luck out here on a different card? I know you did, Sag. I've seen it from my own eyes. Okay, let's get into some fortune cookie. Fortune cookie. Come through fortune cookies. Hit Sag with a situation. Oh, opportunities. An important offer will be made. Be prepared and dress to impress. Oh, we dress to impress. Come on now. Another one. Opportunities. A stranger is about to change your life. What did we say about a rescuer? Exciting times and plenty of action. Plus, a special family reunion looks likely. Okay. Okay, Sag. I'm down for the cause. You feel me? <laughs> oh, look at this. Here. Jealousy. Watch who you trust with your personal secrets and plans. Spend time outdoors with nature to reconnect and replenish. Now, let me tap in. Because jealousy, we know out here that you get unstable folk. Oh, that was right there. Unstable folk are up in your energy. Folks, you know, they up in your energy and they unstable. Yep, and, they, and it's a lot of causes of why you... Got so much on your mind. Mm -hmm. Not just that. Sexuality. Somebody ain't had none. That's the energy I get. Maybe it's just because I ain't had none. I ain't had none. I ain't had none. Forever. I'm talking about forever. Okay. Sexuality. Ex 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 Y'all. Oh, fast because I'm talking about forever and it almost stung again. All right, I'm gonna remind myself so I don't cry. Sexuality, exciting existing relationships could find a new passion and heighten sexual attraction. Opportunities look here, we go again with the opportunities for marriage and good family life are strong, but if single, beware of temptation that could lead to trouble. A child will also bring great joy. <coughs> Sage, I'm locked up in the closet. And they got a cat and the little hairs is just running all over the place. You hear me? Just all over the place. <laughs> okay, let's get into this. I guess the witch's wisdom deck in my hands. Let's see what the witch's wisdom deck want to say. And then I got a couple more decks. What I get? I made it with the tarot deck before I do the angel answers. And that's the last thing. Because I think it's every kind of deck. <laughs> okay. Tarot cards, period. We not even got the... <laughs> Somebody do tarot, I do tarot. Tarot is not a bad thing. It's actually a fun thing. It make a lot of sense. It say a lot of stuff. And it is cards. And they say what they say. And so here we are. You can get some guidance out of this. Oh, and look. Inside the little things. These are some of the cards. 
That's so adorable. The cards that's actually in this deck is on this card. That is adorable. I oh, love the NA purple, so you know, that's my favorite color. Sagittarius, you know so much about me. <laughs> and I love you guys so much. So much. I don't know, I'm about ready to make a song. You thought I don't make songs no more? I make songs all the time. Pinnacle. Respect. Put some respect on it. I am Mama Bank. Look at this. Cards are just turned over. Herbal Kitchen. Alchemist. Okay. Again, you out here attracting stuff. Using some spells, maybe. Somebody putting something together. Just because I'm using this deck don't mean this ain't true. You feel me what I'm saying? We saying that some cards that people in here intellectually IQ is amazingly high. We see in these cards that in this Sagittarius energy, somebody no magic. <laughs> somebody no magic. Somebody know how to call things into existence. Somebody's spiritual awakeness is so powerful. Okay. Sag, every time I read a reading for Sag, I get some extra powerful feelings, some extra exciting energy. Earth, homecoming, and at them boundaries. I feel like, what is this? <coughs> it's okay, I'm gonna be okay, Sag. Thank you for your concern. But, oh, let's hit it with some, uh, mm, and they fell in reverse. I'm gonna hit it with the tarot cards, and then we're gonna ask the angels. It fell in reverse. Five of Wands. It's harmony being restored. It's some jealous energy in homecoming is here so somebody is coming home it's a reunion happening we did get that it's a special family reunion so it's something uh wonderful about this energy the tower moment what the full energy again wow Okay, so somebody is seriously stepping out. And again, somebody, so, somebody is so intellectually uh, above average in Sagittarius land. Somebody so, uh, my gosh, I see so much. I see somebody so overly, abundantly loving to the point where giving sometimes makes you feel like you giving too much i felt that way before that's when you gotta back up and say my giving is because i love to give i just step out on faith on some things you just jump out there and give so much of yourself that sometimes you feel like you gotta cut it off you gotta uh, stand your ground you can't participate in this no more i can't do this no more i can't do this but it make you feel good to do that harmony is restored a tower moment happened a upheaval was a sudden situation that was divinely guided to make sure that you made it through something that has been standing in a way or 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 a divorce or or losing a house or a job or something that was mad crazy like i mean like something that was so devastating that it caused you to want to stand guard against your heart and as you should as you should but you are who you are. Look at that flipped out five of cups. You are who you are. You are an empath who carries around a lot of other people's emotional baggage. You carry your own at the same time. And I, I, I want you to know that me for myself personally, I truly do feel like you the temple, right? So in my temple, I got some shelves. And in this room, it's a lot of emotional baggage that I had to store away. I don't even remember unless you bring it up. 
then you would make me remember something that I done stored away. But listen here, somebody been walking around with this sadness, this hurt, this disappointment, these upsets, and just been walking around with them. But it's time for release. I feel that strongly. Like, your energy is elevating. Of course, as you get older, you get wiser. Of course, as you get older, if you keep learning, you get wiser. Of course, if you keep seeking for knowledge, then you're going to get wiser. Okay? And the situations that you are overcoming. Mm, I want to I say family curses that you are breaking here it's situations where they told you don't do this don't do that but i see somebody good at doing magic somebody good at the ability to write things down and it come true somebody good at dreaming and it actually happens Somebody good at talking about something and it come to pass. Somebody good at that. All of them things are revealed in every reading that I do for a Sagittarius. So I want you to know that every, any, all your energy is about elevation, learning, spirituality, spiritual awakeness, world uh, awakeness. Because you know that you only temporarily uh, asset amongst the earth amongst the living <clears throat> oh look at this i love it it's the empress out here now one of these cards says something about a baby was gonna bring great joy somebody is pregnant congratulations sagittarius somebody or you done got somebody pregnant Ooh, congratulations all births is a good asset if you bringing them a good foundation and they start with First of all, them being in fear of you. They ain't got to fear nobody else, but they better fear you. Okay? And then, absolutely love is that in itself. Because without us having to have them directed, we had been misdirected. So, Empress is here. Uh, this is a lot of energy, I feel like. That at this moment, somebody is divinely guided, divinely protected, has divinely set a foundation, whether female or male, set a foundation for your life, like Sagittarius cover, cover for your life. Nine of coins, rewards of your labor, what you did in your life to change. <clears throat> what you did in your life your what is it maturity <sighs> ah, having grown through everything you mature from certain things my the point somebody been working at this for a long time too stubborn to walk away too loyal to change we asking the angels some questions wait Sag that's the first answer wait but creation is here. Beauty, art, fertility. Somebody is definitely getting new opportunities. Setting out on new adventures. Walking into the unknown. Being realistic about what's happening in your life. Bankruptcy could have happened, but you stand in firm. Even with the sadness and emotional baggage. You still abundant. If you believe. Mm. Mm. I feel a male energy who is very protecting, <clears throat> very loyal. Been standing next to somebody for a minute here. Meditation brings answer. Forgiveness. Forgive somebody. You got a lot of emotional baggage. Forgive, and a lot of that baggage gonna close up. Listen to your intuition. It's up to you if you believe. Don't stop. Bottom of the deck within the next few months in this situation will improve. Sag, thank you so much. I truly do love and appreciate you. Hit the like and subscribe. Y'all supporting me for free. And that's amazing. I truly do love y'all. And I'll be back soon. And until we meet again, be amazingly you. 
Because Sash, can't nobody do you like you do you. And I love y'all so much. I do personal reads. Check the box below. Later.